Taco Tuesday is here, and that means that you are about to watch a delicious taco recipe for quick carne asada from my year-long Taco Tuesday video series. I know that it might seem crazy, but I really love tacos. Yeah, I'm sure you just thought, I do too. But the thing is, is that I have the Taco Tuesday cookbook to prove it. And this year, I'm doing something insane. Every Tuesday, I cook a recipe from the book with you so you can follow along. Tell me which ones are your favorites so far by leaving a comment below, all that stuff. Of course, I'm going to link where to get the book, the recipes, all that jazz right below this video in the description box. And now, it's taco time. These carne asada tacos are going to be your new favorite taco recipe, at least for now, because this skillet version of the original slow roasted recipe is super easy. This recipe was inspired by my local taco shop because they make a killer carne asada. And I decided to recreate this in a more realistic way for a full-time working mom of three. The results were really tasty, so I couldn't help myself but to include them in the cookbook, the Taco Tuesday cookbook. In this small bowl, I'm going to combine some ground cumin with garlic powder, salt, a pinch of cayenne, and some olive oil. Half of the marinade is gonna go inside this large zip bag with one pound of sliced steak. The rest of the marinade is going to go into the other zip bag along with my sliced peppers and onions. You wanna zip these closed and distribute the marinade around. Into the fridge they go for about four hours or overnight. Since this recipe requires some time for the meat and veggies to marinate, I'll usually do this step either the night before I plan to make these tacos for dinner, making it a great meal prep option for you. We're going to first cook the steak for about six to nine minutes, making sure to flip all the pieces so they cook evenly. Once it's cooked, I'm gonna transfer the meat onto a plate. I'm gonna add peppers and onions. I'm gonna cook these down, stirring frequently for about seven minutes or until fork tender. Then I'm gonna return the steak to the pan and combine the two. I'm gonna cook them for about two minutes or so, just enough to coat everything and heat it through. I can't wait for you to smell this quick carne asada cooking in your own skillet. While this finishes, I'm going to give my corn tortillas a quick warm in the skillet right here. You can, of course, use a microwave, oven, or a gas stove top. Whatever rocks your taco. The best part is almost here, but first, let's assemble. Let's place some of the steak and veggie mixture onto the tortilla, follow it with some sour cream, cilantro, and a squeeze of fresh lime juice. Oh my goodness, you guys, the steak is cooked to perfection, and that fresh lime juice brings out all the bold, smoky flavors of the cumin and cayenne. Unbelievable. This may be the best taco you've watched yet. Of course, this quick carne asada makes a terrific salad topper if you are eating low carb, a lettuce cup, stuffer, and so much more. I'm just the type of person that can eat tacos every day. And if you are that type of person too, you're just going to love this Taco Tuesday series. Grab the recipe and the link to the Taco Tuesday cookbook below this video to make every Tuesday the best day of your week. And while you're down there, click that red subscribe button so we can hang out and eat tacos together every single Tuesday. See you next time.